No conservation efforts continue to reestablish the whooping crane population in the wild. The species was pushed to the brink of extinction by unregulated hunting and also the loss of habitat, but the state has made progress in recent years. Taylor Tool joins us live with the progress and potential changes, Taylor. You know, Jim Marcel, since conservation efforts began in 2011, the wild whooping crane population is up by 70 here in Louisiana. Nationwide, those numbers are around 800. Now, this brings about a debate. Is the endangered species just that, endangered? In the Vermilion Parish wetlands, it's nesting and chick rearing season. Experts with the Louisiana Department of Wildlife and Fisheries are working to keep track of the growing whooping crane population. It's tremendous progress in the right direction, um, but but still, if you think about you know less than a thousand individuals, it's still a pretty small, pretty small population. Um, so, whooping cranes as a whole um, are currently listed as an endangered species, but all of the reintroduced populations are classified as experimental non-essential. At the federal level, there has been talk of reclassifying the whooping crane from endangered to threatened, which some worry could loosen protections. Regardless of the national classification, the Louisiana Department of Wildlife and Fisheries will continue to reintroduce whooping crane populations in the wild. What we found is that a lot of them left the marsh, and when they left the marsh, um, you just have to get up in the air and you see a tremendous amount of water um, in the form of rice and crawfish fields. And so we've had a lot of birds that have ended up spending time um, and actually living, nesting, raising their chicks um, on private property. Now we reached out to officials at the federal level. They say any talk of reclassifying the bird is just talk at this point. They say, however, before any decision is made, they will be reaching out to conservation groups and agencies in Acadiana and the rest of Louisiana for input. Live in Lafayette, Taylor Tool, KATC TV3.